Hello there. This is a video to learn how to play movies on Kodi or any other media through Kodi. Uh, once in the gaming interface, you're gonna go all the way to the left and uh, you're gonna go up till it says Android. First, you need to be connected to the internet in order to play Android apps. So you're gonna go all the way into settings. Then you're gonna set up your Wi-Fi uh, network on the Wi-Fi button there. Make sure it's enabled and you put your password from your Wi-Fi. Then once you're done with that, you're gonna go back. Once you're connected to the internet, you can go into the Android apps. You can play Netflix, Spotify, or Kodi. In this case, we're gonna go into Kodi. I'm using the remote, but you can also use the controller. I recommend using the remote. Uh, in in Kodi, you can do many things. You can play many media. Uh, for now, we're gonna go into videos, and then uh, the application I use on Kodi for movies, it's Exodus. So it should be right here, or you can go into the actual files and or add-ins. I'm gonna click on Exodus, and it's gonna open a, a new window. In here, I'm gonna either choose movies, TV shows, whatever I wanna watch. So I'm gonna click on movies, and then there's many categories you can choose from. I'll choose for now most popular, and it's gonna show the most popular movies on Exodus. Uh, usually, you gotta wait till it's working. It all depends on your internet connection. Um, or if it's doing updates right now, it's doing some updates. That's why it's taking longer. Uh, some movies that are still in the movie theater are going to not be in good quality. So I, I wouldn't expect like Logan to be on Blu-ray quality, but other movies that are already on the red box or Netflix are going to play like super quality. So in here, you're just going to choose any movie you want to watch. Uh, you can go all the way down and keep going and uh, once you choose a movie so hold on it's doing some updates all right right here is doing updates so whenever it's doing updates you gotta wait because it's working and it's grabbing information that's why it holds the actual selection so that's a good thing to know so in here like you can go down and uh, let's see, choose Deadpool. Okay, so I selected Deadpool and I gotta wait. Don't keep pressing the OK button because you're gonna just freeze it. You gotta wait a little bit. It's gonna say working and then it's gonna look for providers. Uh, it takes a minute to look for providers and then it's gonna give me a list of different qualities of the movie I selected. And then from there, I can select the actual movie. So it takes like a minute uh, to look for providers of the movie. It's okay, 96%. Actually taking like 30 something seconds so it's an average is a move it's a minute <clears throat> once you get into the screen you can choose the actual quality whenever it says HD it's gonna be really good quality usually the first ones are gonna be HD so I always choose the first or second one if the first uh, provider doesn't work you can keep going to the second and third till one works sometimes some don't work, others work perfectly fine at the first time. So it all depends on the providers. Um, so once you click it, uh, it should start loading the movie and it should start playing right away. Thank you so much. If you have any questions, let me know and uh, and we can help you right away. Thanks.